Yeah, I'm just showing off the other two paths. The one with Hawkeye and the one with Mustang. That's all of them. I wonder if Crowley's watching us from somewhere. That might be. Let's keep moving forward. <sighs> Ed, is something the matter? Edward, there's no time to dawdle. Hey, Lieutenant Hawkeye, I'm gonna have to take someone's life, aren't I? Perhaps that may be the end result. That's what I thought. But it could be the other way around. It could be you or me or Alphonse who gets killed. <sighs> Don't ever assume that the chances of that are slim. Just keep moving forward with all you've got, not to take away but to protect what's important to you. What's important to me? The resolve to protect someone is far greater than the force that tries to take away. That's what I believe. Not to take away, but to protect. Yeah. Al, we're all getting out of here in one piece. Got that? I hear ya, and I've got your back. So let's get home together, okay? Let's make it out of here alive! 
You bet. That's a promise, Al. Hawkeye's good luck charm. Increased firearm damage dealt by 30%. Okay, I never use firearms. Okay. Thank you! If you thought that was inspirational, just think. We still have to go and see um, Roy Mustang about what he has to say. Think about that. We still have to see Roy Mustang. We're just skipping through everything so we can just get back to where we were. out of this room. Ah, uh, please don't tell me we're at a dead end. Lieutenant! Uh, um, what are you looking at? I thought there might be some clues on this steely, but it's unreadable. The writing is in ancient runes. Ancient runes? Of Lebus? Well, there's no way I could read those either. What should we do now? Invertebrates! That's what you get for not taking me with you! Who's there? G Gramps! What are you doing here? Those damn soldiers tried to hold me down, so I gave them a complimentary ass-kicking. Those pathetic troops couldn't lay a finger on me, even if you trained them for the next hundred years. Anyway, you want to know what's on that steely, right? Leave it to me. That's right up my alley. Sir, I must tell you that disobeying the Colonel's orders is punishable by law. Please do not be so selfish. Lady, I told your boss you'd be worthless going into the ruins without an expert. Apparently, your boss isn't very good at understanding the situation at hand. Wouldn't you agree? He was only trying to protect you. Come on, Lieutenant. He's already followed us this far. You can't do anything about that. Yeah, besides, we are at a loss for what to do next. It's not that I don't understand the duties you military people have, but you gotta stand in my shoes too. I have to do this. I want to put an end to everything. Please, Lieutenant. Gramps. <sighs> the 
Very well, sir. I'll take full responsibility if anything happens. But please, don't do anything rash. Much obliged, miss. I like how the fact that they actually recorded separate dialogues for each of the paths. I'll stay on the lookout for any golems that might appear. Mr. Glossner, please start deciphering the stealing. And this part's Another. exactly the same. Mm. Two. Right. Hmm. Yeah, this part of the dialogue is exactly the same. Or exactly. Voice, come on. What? Oh no. I'm just seeing if there's any other dialogue changes. Wait a sec. What? Let's be well, your channel time the current. Waiting for the Yeah. Okay, so it's exactly the same. Now it's time for the last one, and then it's back to the actual story at hand. Now it's on for the last one, and then back to where we were in our actual save game. The Colonel was in this transmutation circle. Do you want to go in this one, Ed? to approach this. Be more careful, I almost made charcoal out of you. So what are you boys doing here? 